Okay, I've got my Artiboy here, but it's not any normal Artiboy. It's an Artiboy FX. What does FX mean? It means it's been equipped with one of these, which is the Artiboy Flash Mod chip. It gives you a AT Tiny processor to update the bootloader and a flash memory module that includes all of the Artiboy game. So you well, simply open your Artiboy, as I've already done here, and you can match the solder pads to the holes on the mod chip, and you'll solder it in place, and that gives you access to all the games. So this has already been pre-installed in it, and I have my uh, favorite Artiboy game on here of the moment, uh, Minesweeper. And so we can use the tool that Mr. Blinky has created to update and activate the... Uh, so we'll upload the hex file and that will upload the activator sketch to the Artiboy. So what we will do is flash the mod chip. It's the first step. All right, so that was successful. And now we'll flash the bootloader. All right, so that works. So now this has the bootloader in it. Uh, this is the FX bootloader. Um, it's a little tough to see, but it's got the USB boot uh, symbol on there and that's what happens when you don't have any games loaded on your uh, external memory so we'll use this other button here and click upload flash image and look at it go we're putting in looks like that seven megs kill a that's bytes, big B, right? For bytes. So, yeah, a little bit less, about six megs. That's a lot of games. <laughs> I think it's gonna play a video, maybe. That's maybe that's what most of the activity goes on here. I guess I'll sh while that's uploading, I'll give you guys a better look at uh, the flash chip here. Um, this is just an alpha version, but actually they did print some, it doesn't make any sense. They're all in the same layer, but they only printed the silk screen over here, but there was actually characters over the whole thing. So I'm not really sure what happened. It's actually pretty surprising. I don't know. You can't see that on the camera, but you can actually almost in person, you can actually almost make out the team ARG logo there, which is actually. So the resolution is really good on this. So, and um, yeah, this is basically ready to go. So we'll be doing some kind of a crowdfunding campaign soon to be able to produce these and mass product produce them. And we'll also pre-mod the Artiboy, so you can actually buy. The Art of Boy with this already installed with all the games. You don't even need to do this. You just get, pick it up and play it and switch through the games. And it'll also have um, the FX engraved in the back with a unique uh, serial number uh, hex value on the back for each one. So it looks like this is almost done. So great. So it's updated the flash successfully. So we'll go ahead and turn it off and turn it back on. All right, look at that. So we've got the Artiboy FX, and we've got a bunch of different games by the different creators. So we can run the Fresh Cart test. All right. And this is the, the video running off of the, uh, off of a flash memory module. I think this is where most of the space is on this flash. This is quite large. I think this fills up the whole space. So this is great. So, 
don't know if this implements the hold all the buttons thing. Is it like hold A and B and left and right? Or is it left and right and B? I don't know. Well, you we can turn it off and turn it back on. There should be a uh, quick reset button. Oops. Soon enough. But let's go ahead and try Castle Boy. That's great. So this is all done even out with it disconnected from the computer. So if you want to switch a game, you can. You just uh, try Art Adventure. And that's great because you don't even need to worry about the USB drivers anymore. So really, this is only for charging. I guess you can upload new uh, flash images. So that's it. That is the Artiboy FX. So this would be laser engraved here. And then on the bottom, there would be a, uh, a hex value, uh, probably 16-bit hex value there. And that's pretty much it. So keep your eyes peeled.